Hello everybody, it's Monday, I think it's the 5th of November, and I'm making some some stoppers for my wine flagons. So I'm just, I've just got the camera a little bit closer today, maybe just to, so first of all we form the, the bit that you hold on to of the stopper. Just make that so you can get your fingers onto it nicely and feel like you can you've got some purchase there, if you know what I mean. So sort of give it a little bit of a rounded top. And then have to sort of bear in mind as well the the width of the inside of the um, the neck of the wine flag and where this is going to locate so and then so I'm I'm choosing that as my diameter there across my finger to my finger and thumb there and now I'm just effectively pushing down this is one of these one of these throwing jobs that we do where we don't actually lift up but we push I sort of I push it down and squeeze it as I go to get that kind of tapered look. All right, quite a nice sort of concave curve there. And you can do these basically any size. This is the way I've sort of adopted to to make these. I'm not saying this is the only way to do it. Alright. There we go. Right, now. Take a knife. What I do is make a sort of little marker with my index finger there, like that. And then I hold it. I don't actually hold it. I just get ready to catch it. Wet the blade of the knife. Just push it into the centre, and that's it. You see? And I've got it then in my in my fingers, firmly, so I can put that over there on the bat with the other ones that I've got, and go on to the next one. I've got two or three more to do. I'm going to be going on to be making some mugs, so you can join me later to do that. Okay everybody, we'll see you then, bye bye.